Welcome back to Face the State. Before we get to that interview with former Hartford Mayor Mike Peters, I want to pass along a personal message from the mayor and his family I received after I taped the conversation with the mayor. They want you to know that the mayor has been ill, and the illness, you'll certainly notice, has taken a toll on his appearance. Now, Mayor Peters doesn't want to talk about this publicly right now in terms of the details and the nature of the illness, and we certainly respect his privacy. His family also wants you to know the mayor is working with doctors and they remain optimistic about his future. We, of course, will keep you posted. Now here's that interview. City Hall is now the mayor's office under investigation by a grand jury. You were called to testify. What can you tell us about that? All I know is I was there for 15 minutes. I didn't have much information and they asked me to leave and I left. And I have not been back since. I can tell you this though, I think the other shoe is about to drop. It's gone on far, far too long. Uh, and then with the extension and then what are you in our year and something now it's a running clock I think you see something happen fairly soon so you and now how does this work were you subpoenaed yes I was subpoenaed uh, I went before the judge of the grand jury and uh, and they asked me a couple questions that's all it was and it wasn't anything that was mind-boggling I didn't have much to offer so that was it did they ask specific questions about Mayor Perez no. So, so it was basically about what you knew about City Hall and how it worked? Yeah, or? how it worked when I was there. And that's, that's pretty much what it was. So you weren't asked about any wrongdoing and things like that? No. You know, it, it seems like there's, uh, there's been uh, you know, sh sort of a shaking of confidence in the city because of this grand jury investigation. As you mentioned, it's been going on for over a year. Are you finding that? Yes. Uh, people are really disenchanted with the mayor's office. Uh, some of the things that he's done with the parking garages and stuff like that. Uh, some of the contracts that have been put out, it doesn't, uh, doesn't bode well.